Majesty the Queen is among the first visitors as once again Britain's shop window is open to the world. And at Earl's Court, Her Majesty puts the Empire first. Ostrich feathers from South Africa. A bouquet of orchids from the Botanical Gardens in Burma has been specially flown from India and is presented to Her Majesty by Miss Mamie Kang, a student from Rangoon University. By the way, Her Majesty is wearing a velveteen tailored coat with a silver fox fur and a velvet hat as she takes her place in the fashion theatre for the parade of clothes that British artists are designing for the world. Give a girl a mirror and a hat and she'll play for hours. But mayn't we have a look? How do you do? A garden party frock in white lace that would make lovely Ascot lovelier still. And the one they're all talking about, with the petticoat two inches below the hem of the frock. And they call it Russell While You Walk. And in 1939, here comes the bride in a crinoline gown of Her Majesty Queen Mary spends more than three and a half hours inspecting nearly a hundred stands. You can best judge Queen Mary's interest by the official figures which have just been published. She has made 38 visits to the fairs and has walked more than a hundred miles. British manufacturers and British salesmen are grateful to our royal family for the interest that means so much to the industries of the empire.